Hey guys, Paul Smith Mania. I'm just relaxing in the studio and uh, messing with the Fairlight and DX7. And Kyle Box had this question. Hi Paolo, first of all, thank you for all your effort putting all this video material from beginning to YouTube. It's really helpful, especially work through on how to drum patterns on vintage drum machines. I have a question for you and it's bugging me for a long time. Can you recreate the lead synth sound from Ian Hammer's Crockett's theme? I have tried many times with different synths, but it's not the same. The sound itself is really special. Maybe he used Fairlight R1 patch. If you do a bit of cover of this song, it will be perfect. Cheers, Roberts. Yeah, I was messing around with the Fairlight R1, for sure, it's there. And also, uh, I found that um, the Harp 2 sound on the DX7 combined with it, it sounds like it. So let's go to the Fairlight and DX7 and take a look. All right, guys, uh, here's the Fairlight. And of course, uh, I've loaded the R1 sounds on it from uh, the human, humans one um, disc, classic disc. And on the DX7, I've got, let me focus here if you can focus. I got the Harp 2 sound, also it's one of the factory patches classic. So I've got the Fairlight and DX7, and here is uh, the good old Sync Clavier. Hopefully I can uh, get this set up as well very soon. I need a card for the computer. So all I did really, since my Fairlight card is uh, acting up, I have a MIDI out from the DX7, and simply, do, 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 it goes to the MIDI out of the Fairlight. Like so. And uh, so the two machines are MIDI to each other. Or of course you can also do the opposite. Go from the MIDI out of the Fairlight to the MIDI of the DX7. But for the purpose of this demo, right now the volume of the DX7 is down and we're controlling the Fairlight from the DX7. So this is only the Fairlight via MIDI. And then when we set the volume up for the Harp 2 on the DX7, you get the typical Crockett lead sound. Of course, then you would need like uh, the sequence synth bass line and the Lindrum playing the background and a wonderful stream pad that's also there. I plan to have this uh, card on the Fairlight finally repair if I can and then um, we're gonna try to find out how to play the whole thing. But uh, in the meantime I hope this helps you for, for the lead and there are also other elements in there of course uh, for the production but I hope this gets you in the ballpark. Thanks for watching.